doing? Good night, my friends. Tonight we're going to read a book called Don't Let the Pigeon Stay Up Late. Words and Pictures by Mo Willems. Don't let the pigeon stay up late. Oh, good. It's you. Listen, it's getting late and I need to brush my teeth. Can you do me a favor? What? Don't let the pigeon stay up late. Okay. Thanks. First of all, I'm not even tired. Okay. But you had to go to sleep. In fact, I'm in the mood for a hot dog party. You can have a hot dog party. What did you say? You can have a hot dog party. No. Hmm. I hear there's a good show about birds on TV tonight. Should be very educational. I can't, I can't see them. How about five more minutes? No. Come on, what's five minutes in the grand scheme of things? You can't. <laughs> what? What? I'm not even tired! Right, you have to go to sleep. You know, we never get to talk anymore. Tell me about your day. My day was fantastic. Oh, I've got a great idea. We could count the stars. No! Can I have a glass of water? No. Studies show that pigeons need hardly any sleep at all. No. It's the middle of the day in China. No. I'll go to bed early tomorrow night instead. No. Hey, <laughs> ho, 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 this here pigeon just won't go. Please. No. No. My bunny wants to stay up late too, you know. No. You can't say no to a bunny, could you? Yeah, I can. <laughs> okay, that wasn't a yawn. I was just stretching my mouth. Um, oh, 110% awake. You haven't heard the oh, last of me. Great work. Thanks. And then you dream about how it's Good night. The end. The end.